information on the refinery. The project comprises uh, four major project areas. We have the Imbegu water intake station and corresponding water pipelines for the abstraction and transmission of water from Lake Albert. It's about 10 kilometers distant from the refinery site itself, which will be located in Kabale, uh, in Hoima district. Uh, then we have a 211 kilometer multi-products pipeline for evacuation of refined products from the refinery to the storage terminal. The project the developers are, uh, of course, the UNOC through the subsidiary that I'm accounting officer for, the Uganda Refinery Holding Company, on behalf of Government of Uganda. Uh, but we also uh, have a uh, joint venture development with the Albertine Grab and Refinery Consortium, um, who uh, comprise Yatra Africa, Saipem, Baker Hughes, and Lionworks Capital. Uh, the refinery will produce roughly 8 million litres a day of uh, white products and to put that into perspective currently Uganda imports about 6 million litres of white products uh, daily. Refinery products uh, will be producing Euro 5 standard uh, gasoline and diesel will produce enough jet fuel to meet uh, Entebbe Airport's needs uh, and will produce uh, about 650 tonnes a day of LPG which is 20 times what Uganda currently uses. So it'll be an important part of uh, getting Uganda, uh, let's say, more green in how we uh, utilize uh, our energy and move people away from charcoal and firewood to, to, to LPG.